2023 wearable fashion trends what are in style and how to style them hello ladies and welcome back to my channel even new here i go by adele velar and in today's video we're going to be looking at the wearable fashion trends of this year so the first wearable fashion trends for this year are flared and wide leg denim jeans finally something that i absolutely love wearing i absolutely find wide leg and flared trousers very flattering of course if they're not too oversized the perfect trend for me that will never be a trend for me because i do not follow trends and i think everyone should wear what they love and what fits to their personality and their aura and all that and flared and wide leg jeans can be very often overdone like this picture here ladies this is not classy this is a trend i want to keep our wide leg and flared denim jeans still classy so we can wear them for many years to come and they do not look outdated and the trend already started rolling in mid 2022 i saw the trends on many websites already rolling in and they're all transferring into the year 2023 as i mentioned previously do not buy your wide leg or flared trousers or flared denim jeans too oversized they are going to look very outdated very quickly keep them more classy and decent so you can wear them for many years to come like these wild leg jeans here or these flare jeans here absolutely love how it fits on her silhouette it just looks like it was made for her and i cannot see this wide leg or flare jeans going out of style that quick and i'm so grateful for this wide leg flared leg trouser <laughs> denim jeans trend because your leg finally have some space to breathe and it's also the perfect excuse to wear all that heels that you're probably having in your wardrobe that you can combine very beautifully with your wide leg jeans of course you don't need to wear heels with your wide leg or flared out trouser it doesn't need to be that much just a little is enough to just elevate your whole entire outfit and your whole entire look styling wise i would recommend to make sure to wear something a little bit tighter on the top and wear a little bit of a heel five inches let's say three to five inches is enough just a little bit now moving on to the next 2023 fashion trend that is absolutely wearable and that would be sheer everything sheer dresses sheer skirts sheer blouses literally sheer everything if you have sheer clothing pieces in your wardrobe time to get them out just like what i'm doing here i'm already wearing my sheer blouse that i absolutely love and that is already sewn in so many shops already because they are in trend but again for me a piece like this do not go out of trend i find them to be timeless pieces that do not go out of trend if you do not go overboard with a sheer piece you're getting and with the sheer dress honestly i cannot see myself wearing a full sheer outfit where you can see my bra my whole entire undergarment no that is not for me not classy not an item that i can see myself going out and enjoying myself no 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 <laughs> okay but what i would wear would be this dress for instance look we have a little bit of sheer detailing going on here and there very sophisticated looking and you're still in trend with an outfit like this with a dress like this and also with a blouse like this where there's a little bit sheer detailing going on on the arms on the chest the back you're still on trend but you still look very classy and timeless even want to follow this trend but you want to still keep it classy do not wear clothing pieces that looks like this that overly expose your entire body keep it classy but wear wearing a dress like this one here and like the one I showed you previously make sure to keep it a little bit more sophisticated and just show that you're up to date but you're not overdoing it because you know how to style your trendy but not so trendy pieces you're keeping it timeless but you are on trend moving on to the next 2023 wearable 
fashion trends and that will be colors totally in style and absolutely wearable cobalt blue saffron red colors everywhere absolutely beautiful colors that i can personally see myself wearing also if i'm a neutral kind of girl i love my neutral colors my safe colors that i feel the most comfortable in and especially cobalt blue is a color that i absolutely would wear and i find to really never go out of style come on cobalt blue such a beautiful color also this year's trend is color blocking like color blocking one side is like this kind of color let's say pink and the other side is in a lighter pink shade or in a cobalt blue and then in a lighter cobalt blue so that kind of color blocking is trending this year ladies absolutely something that i cannot see myself wearing i do not love color blocking that's not my kind of style but i can see myself wearing cobalt blue as i mentioned and also saffron red is a color that i think i might try out this year spring and summer a beautiful color that is not so in your face and in my opinion still very wearable especially Especially this dress oh, I absolutely love this dress such a gorgeous dress and gorgeous cut and the color I just can see myself wearing it on vacation in spring summer because that is where I tend to wear my most colors on vacation would you wear saffron red colors would you wear cobalt blue is it a color for you yes or no let me know down below as well so now let's look at some pictures on how I would style these two colors. I will definitely style it like this one here. I can see myself wearing a cobalt blue dress or blouse or trousers combined with a neutral color, of course, like black, white, beige, and brown tones. And the saffron color definitely as this gorgeous dress, also as a top like this one here, but I wouldn't necessarily color block any of this color. But this color are in trend for this year and definitely wearable. Corsage are absolutely wearable and in trend this year. Okay, we shouldn't necessarily overdo this trend by wearing it like this or like this, but it depends on your personal style. Keep it classy and wear it like this, for instance. Corsage is something that I find never goes out of style, depending on the type of clothing pieces you decide to buy and have that corsage integrated into that clothing piece. Now, for instance, I have this corsage dress from Zara that do not really look like it is a trendy piece. It looks very classy and will definitely not go out of style. And also this dress that I bought a couple of years ago from Misguided also has this corsage going on on the middle of course <laughs> and in my opinion also will never go out of style these are timeless pieces trends they always come back year after year and here yeah, corsage everything so corsage can also be integrated into a blouse or a t-shirt like this one here definitely something I would wear I necessarily wouldn't wear my a corsage like this and go out the door this would just be way too much for me and to attention grabbing now if it's your style please wear it and rock it but if you want to keep it a little bit more classy like how we do on this channel then i would recommend for you to add this trend like these clothing pieces and these outfits and this style into your wardrobe this year if you do not have anything like this already of course ladies 2023 wearable fashion trend that i can see myself wearing definitely yes now moving on to the next 2023 wearable fashion trends and that will be ballet flats i mean are they coming back in style or were they always in style in trend i've not really seen these ballet flats go anywhere in the last couple of years i've always seen people wearing their ballet flats pointed almond toes rounded yes back in trend do i love ballet flats am i here for them yes definitely they are very comfortable depends on the kind of ballet flats you decide to purchase on the other hand i personally am not the biggest fan of ballet flats because i just tend to walk very awfully in ballet flats for me to actually wear this ballet 
flat trend this year. I definitely need to get some ballet flats with heels, with three to five centimeters of heels. But if they're entirely flat, I cannot see myself wearing them. I just don't really wear shoes without any heels. I love wearing shoes with heels because they just makes an entire outfit more sophisticated and your attitude change with just a little bit of heels, ladies. Try it out, for real. Now, ballet flats like this one here are in trend, like this one, and also this one here, this pointed ballet flat. Moving on to the next 2023 wearable fashion trends, and that will be leather. Leather, everything. Leather jackets, leather blazers, leather trousers, skirts, dresses, everything in leather from the head till toe. Am I here for this trend? Yes, ladies, I'm here because I'm a leather kind of girl. I love leather. Would I wear a whole entire leather outfit? Probably yes, yes. But in a more classy way, like this one here, like this outfit, and I've probably also shown you some of my leather, do not go out of trend. Leather are timeless pieces that you can own in your wardrobe. Of course, if you get the leather pieces in timeless styles, like this one here. And not like this one here, ladies. If you want to keep all this trend, let's say, going on for many years to come, keep them more classy, like I've mentioned, like probably one billion times. <laughs> into this video but i just want to explain to you ladies most of these pieces that are now in trend are clothing pieces that i've already owned in my wardrobe for already quite some time so for a couple of years now and they are now in trend so just think about in a couple of years the clothing pieces that you decide to purchase in a classy style will be in trend again because you bought them in a classy style so they will stay on trend in a few years again or you can also wear them forever and hand them down let's look at some ways i would style my leather pieces this year so i will definitely style like this with a knee length skirt with a leather jacket that you can tie around your waist and i will also wear it as a whole entire leather dress like this one here and also i won't necessarily wear a leather trouser and a leather blazer hmm Definitely not, no. That would be too much, in my opinion. That would be too, probably too much. I've not tried it out, honestly, but I think I need to try it out with maybe an ankle length trouser and just see how it will work out for me and how I will feel if I walk out the door with an outfit like that. So now moving on to another 2023 wearable fashion trends, and that would be knee length skirts and midi skirts, long skirts in general, and I find them to be absolutely wearable. I love wearing my skirts that are knee length or midi length, a style that just fits to my personality in general. And I love this kind of look, but I wouldn't necessarily like style it this way with a very long slit on the side. I do own a skirt like that, and I know for sure that I've probably not worn it out for the last couple of years because it was trending a couple of years ago as well. Long skirt with slits and that is also what is trending this year. A long skirt, let's say midi skirt with slit. I would say you can get a skirt or get your skirts out that has a little bit of a slit going on but do not overdo it. Do not get a slit skirt that like shows the entire like butt on the side. We do not want that because it's not necessarily very classy but if you want to rock that wear that please definitely midi skirts like this are trending and knee length skirts like this one are trending this whole entire outfit is just giving wow sophistication absolutely love this entire outfit ladies i think i might be recreating some pinterest outfits this year so make sure to watch out for that midi skirt knee length skirt definitely something that is trending but never goes out of style of course if you keep it classy now moving on to the last 2023 wearable fashion trends and that would be big structured bag or big slouchy bags. Now, do I love this trend? No, not really. Would I wear it? Yes, I would. I mean, big bags, but I wouldn't overdo it with the oversized extra, extra large bag. Come on. What do we want to put inside this bag? A whole entire car? No, just joking, ladies. I think it's a little bit too much for my liking. I'm the type of girl, I love my smaller bags. I do not like oversized bags. 
but I can see myself wearing, let's say, um, a midi bag from the sizing, let's say this size of bag, but over the top, extra large barks, not my cup of tea. Bags like this are trending, this slouchy look, hanging, big kind of hobo bag, and also bags like this structured office, large bags are trending as well. They are a little bit overdone, but in my opinion, you have to find the perfect bag that fits to your personal style. Follow this trend, but keep it a little bit more smaller. Yes, maybe like this bag here or like this bag here combined with this outfit. This is something I can see myself also wearing myself in this year. This was it for today's video. The 2023 wearable fashion trend, what is in style and how to style them. I hope I gave you some good ideas on how to style these trends that are in style. What do you think? Are these trends wearable and will you be following some of these trends or do you already have all these items that are trending now in your wardrobe? Let me know down in the comment section below and ladies, I will see you in my next video. If you haven't subscribed and you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe and like and I will see you next time. Goodbye.